I like, I love, this is art, art, yeah, square. My favorite part is the hummingbirds and the eye. When you do community murals, um, you design so it's easy for the community to get involved. So yeah, it is color by numbers, so they have diagrams, they have all the brushes that you need. All you need is a little sweat. You know, it's like helping out the community and, you know, I like painting and there's a little bit of a meditation for me my normal work. It's bringing some more color and joy to the streetscape. We're just making it even more visible that this is a pedestrian space. Many of you know that when the 14th Street Busway was implemented, it was just right before the pandemic started, so we didn't really get a chance to activate the new pedestrian spaces in the way we wanted to. Now we're finally getting around to doing it, and um, we're super excited. Anytime they come in and do a temporary project, it's a great opportunity to do this kind of community engagement. We're thrilled to work with the DOT art program and these two amazing artists. And so the mural behind me is called Collective Visions. This is a part of our efforts to not only fully pedestrianize Union Square and of course prioritize the busway in the city's first busway, but to make sure that we're taking back open space, that we're beautifying these areas, and that we're all doing it together community-led. The inspiration for this mural was based on unity and how nature is our inspiration for unity, how birds and flowers come together as a ecosystem. It is vitally important that our emergency services workers, particularly those in the EMS department, um, ride, you know, riding in ambulances, that they're able to get through our city streets to get to and from emergencies and help New Yorkers. So the busway has been instrumental um, in facilitating that. And coming to Union Square more or less right all my life. And so yeah, it was very different. We did not have the bike lanes, clearly a lot more traffic and congestion. The bus moved very, very slowly. And so I think this has become a place that's really become really welcoming and a symbol for the rest of the city of, of how we can take open space and make it something that really benefits everyone. Oh, this is exciting. We need to do this everywhere. And I love that there's purple. <laughs>